I don't care what anyone has to say. Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, what is up? My name is Dia. Nice of you to join us for today's video. In today's video, we're going to be talking about body mist from Bath & Body Works. Now, if you didn't already know, they recently came out with their luxury collection, which are supposed to be inspired by designer perfumes. Um, I think they came out with 10 in total, but me personally, I only got three of them because these were the ones that I felt were special enough to go into my perfume collection um so we have petal parade which is honestly my favorite out of the whole collection we'll talk about that more and we also have covered in roses and then um viva vanilla so these are the body mists we're going to be talking about in today's video if you want to know how i feel about them definitely stick around and keep on watching now i'll be honest i wasn't going to film a review on this particular collection but i've noticed that petal parade has not been getting a lot of love and i i just felt like it was not right you know so the whole reason why i decided to do this review was because i want to defend Petal Parade because in my very humble opinion she's that girl. Petal Parade from what I've heard is supposed to be inspired by Carolina Herrera. Well let me not put it that way. People say that this smells like Carolina Herrera good girl. I have smelled that perfume but it's been a while and so I don't quite remember what it smells like but if I'm not mistaken it was a sweet fruity floral scent it was it's really nice but I am going to review this particular all the mist actually I'm gonna review them outside of what um they are supposedly supposed to smell like but let's get into it so petal parade for the fragrance notes we have neroli petals orange flower and white woods i will be honest so there's this one perfume that i tried that had like neroli in it and i did not like that scent i did not like that perfume so when i heard that neroli was one of the the like the the notes in this particular fragrance i did not think that i was gonna like it but of all the collection this was the one that i liked this was the one that i knew for sure that i was gonna buy i was like yeah this smells really good because it smells really good i think i got this just like what last week can you guys tell how much of this i've used already i love this stuff but let's get into the juice so i'm gonna spray this here oh <laughs> calm down listen petal parade is a beautiful fruity floral fragrance that neroli like i said i did not like that neroli in that particular perfume but this one i don't know what they did to it but it smells really good like it's floral again i'm not a floral girly but i love that floral note in here the way it mixes with that orange i want to say it's like a sweet orange the way that mixes with that sweet orange it just it brings the scent together it's a sweet fruity floral scent it's beautiful i want to say that it's slightly powdery Eh, well, maybe not really. Maybe not really. But this is such a beautiful scent. Ah. No, this is so beautiful. This is... How? I, I don't understand how anyone can say that they don't like Petal Parade. Like, what? What? I wore this in my office. Like, I, I sprayed a whole bunch on myself. And my um supervisor, she walked into my office. She was like, oh, it smells really good in here. And then I showed this to her. And then she smelt it and she said it reminded her of this perfume she used back in France, like in Paris. It's like, yeah, yeah. One thing about this particular one, it smells very perfumey and the, the scent is really deep. It's a beautiful scent. All right, moving on to the next one. This we have covered in roses. When I, my first impression of this um, fragrance was that, yeah, I actually did like it. And I felt like this was my next favorite one after Petal Parade. It's a very nice rose scent. So for the notes, we have ruby berries, sugared rosebuds, blush amber. I like this particular scent because it's kind of like, um, I don't want to use the word woody, but it has like that kind of vibe to it. It's kind of like um, a slightly woody, not woody, that's not <clears throat> a vibe of a woody fragrance that is like sweet like a, a bent sugary type sweetness and that rose scent note i absolutely enjoy it i think it's really nice i think this will layer very nicely with other like um rose perfumes or just floral perfumes in general this is really nice honestly petal parade is that girl i don't care what anyone has to say according to the streets according to what people are saying this smells a lot like delina i, I think i should probably sample that but 
people say that this smells very close to that one i don't know how true that is but i'm sure there's some truth to it because this is such a very i think it's a very sweet it's a rich rose scent is what i'm trying to say the last one i'm going to be talking about in this particular video is viva vanilla now you guys my first impression of this particular um mist was not a positive one i did not like it because i honestly i wasn't getting that vanilla people were talking about and people say that this smells like vanilla 28 by kali and well some people say it's, it's kind of like a cross between um billy eilish's perfume and vanilla 28 by kali billy eilish's perfume i tried that in a store and as for kali 28 i have that one i have that one so i know what those smell like the first time i sprayed this particular perfume i think because i sprayed it on the paper thing i wasn't getting the true scent so me personally i would advise that if you go into the shop you want to test these out either spray that on your clothes or you spray that on your skin that's where you get like what they truly smell like yesterday i went to the mall and i went to bath and body works i decided i wasn't going to spray it on the cup again i decided to spray this on my skin and you guys you guys she's she's nice she's nice okay oh alcohol i need to wait for that to dissipate a bit more Ooh. yeah oh yeah wait didn't i spray the petal parade because i'm getting hints of that honestly petal parade is that girl i don't care what anyone has to say like, to my nose yeah this smells like a sweet woody vanilla scent and and in the total dry down i get like a very slight it's very slight a very slight resemblance to kali 28 but not exactly but it's there it's there oh that smells good that smells good I think this would be such a perfect layering for any um, sweet woody scents that you have. You can wear this with Kelly 28. You can wear this with Nebras. You can wear this with um, Billie Eilish's perfume. And you get, because it's a vanilla scent, I feel like it will pair with any other perfume you pair that with. I even see these two working very beautifully. Okay, so these are basically the three um, mists from Bath & Body Works luxury collection that I felt were good enough, were, you know, special for my perfume collection um um in terms of longevity if i'm being honest i don't feel like these have a very good longevity because i mean mm, after an hour or two they kind of just fade out or maybe i just go nose blind to it i don't know but i feel like they're not that long lasting um you know chasing fireflies by bath and body works that one is long lasting that one is long lasting fairy tale is also another one that is very long lasting and i think you're the one that one is also very long lasting and this one when we compare these to those particular mists i feel like these are not as long lasting um i have tried the covered in roses like i've actually worn these and the petal parade petal parade i would say like um you get a strong projection two hours maybe and then it kind of fades out this one i'll say kind of around the same time an hour an hour 30 minutes and then it fades away i'm yet to try that for this one but I, I really wouldn't be surprised but then again these are body mists so i guess you shouldn't have too much expectations with longevity because again they're you can just respray them in any case but yeah my absolute favorite is petal parade i absolutely love this scent and i don't know why it's not getting so much love on social media this is a beautiful floral scent a beautiful fruity floral scent that smells very perfumey and i feel like oh seriously i did not think that i would like this mist because of that neroli but the way it mixes with that orange scent note it's almost like a sweet orange scent note and i love that and then the white woods i don't yeah does it smell woody i don't know but i love it i love it so yeah petal parade is number one for me in the whole collection after petal parade the one that comes next for me is covered in roses this is a very beautiful scent it's such a floral scent and i love that there's a bit of like a, a sweetness to it not even a bit i think it's sweet um a kind of like a bench should be sweet i like it i like it i like how that makes us with that rose note it's a beautiful scent and then for the next one we have um viva vanilla this is a sweet woody vanilla scent i get like slight a very slight resemblance to vanilla 28 
I don't know how close this is to be the eyelashes perfume. I don't really get that vibe in my very humble opinion, but it is nice. Yeah, but that concludes my review. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope it was helpful, and I hope to see you guys in my next one. Bye!